know, in through 30 something, I'm not sure how they're doing it. Uh, there's no lineups. They're warming up the other things, the late models first, then we warm up and time trial together. It's there's like 20, 20 some cars. Seven. 27. <laughs>especially you know when it's cold the damp or track you know just yeah. doesn't get going right away but i think we did good there for sure yeah yeah i think the top's just too dirty you can't carry no speed around there then when he moved down he ran through the middle of that there was a wetter spot down there man it just took right off yeah the top just a little too dirty uh, it's just, yeah, you can't get a hold of nothing yeah, yeah, yeah. it just you know, I mean, I think I have good entry speed, but it's just nothing to, nothing to keep you rolling around there. Yeah, you just, it just, you just get stuck out there, and then... Yeah. When you moved down there and got in that wetter shit, it was definitely better than you drove away from them. Yeah, but it was kind of greasy down there before the heat started, so I, but then I saw some turn up, you know, so that I'll go... Did you, did you get a little head start on that start, or did you just go really I'd good? I'd say I got a head start. Like, I went, he kind of followed. Okay. Um... But you still took off pretty good, didn't you? I did. I had no issues, no issues with fire. I don't know. Uh, How much tighter can you get, you think? I mean, I, there's no traction up top there in that shit. I mean, just even, even leading, you just get all fishtail, then you kind of do all the shit on the straightaway, the, the left or right thing, you know what I mean? So I, I think you got to find some way to be tighter. You, you know, you get naked because, like, you just can't. There's not enough like speed to just leg it around there and keep the whole the wing the whole thing loaded. Right. Yep. You're just like dancing all the time. And when you had to run the bottom like that, did it still go off the corner okay? 
Did it go off the corner okay when well, you moved it, down? That's the that's where you benefit. Okay. I guess you know what I'm saying like as far as if you get around three, whatever, obviously slow down, you get around okay. But the exit's what gets you better. Okay, okay. And I think it was actually better down here. I probably didn't slow down enough to run it here on my own, but it was just hard to know. Right. I didn't want to over slow because I just didn't feel good enough to you know, I didn't quite know. But I, I went I ran kinda down lower. And then I, I missed the exit, so then I don't get I don't get as good of an exit. After it was over, I ran a lap lower yet, and I think that was better. Okay. All right.
not near tight enough. Well, I just lay, way labored on the right rear. It's just fucking dead over there. Just roll, I mean, right from the first lap, just fucking rolled up right rear. I mean, it ain't stuck to nothing, but I'm way too tight rolling around there. I mean, as far as that's right. I, I just, you know, I get, the, I get the wing back any farther than that. I hike around so bad on the straightaway all over the fucking place. Then I'm, you know, I'm, I, I'm, I gotta get out of it here. Then I got no entry speed. I'm well, close. cranking a bunch in the right rear is probably not the answer, is it? I don't know. It's just dead, though. I mean, that, that's whatever. I just go over and lay over. I mean, as far as, as far as saying straight up saying tight, I, I don't know to say that it's bad. It's just shit attitude. It's, nothing, it's doing nothing over there. Okay. Okay.